Welcome to Katie's Joy. Today I'll be doing a tutorial for Hallelujah. I became a little bit behind in April for various reasons. May flew by and here we are on the 30th already. It's Memorial Day weekend. It's Sunday and a day to get back to the ukulele. I wanted to do a Hallelujah tutorial and I think I'm going to go ahead and do another one just to kind of get us caught up as well. So here it is, Hallelujah, Leonard Cohen. This is in the key of C. I chose the key of C for a good reason. I love the finger placement. Um, and you'll see what I mean as we get going on this. It's really simple to learn. Another thing too is this song has a way of going over and over the same chords and in, in a progression. Once you know that, you can do all the verses. The hardest part is probably the lyrics. But anyway, on Patreon, you will find a copy of the song with the chords and um, some of the other verses, so you'll have that. All you have to do is just click on it and probably copy and paste it onto whatever you've got or download it um, and it'll print out. So anyway, that's there for you. There's no fee for it or anything like that. But I just wanna show you these chords, okay? We have the C chord over here, then the A minor and C. Now when we do the intro, we're gonna to toggle back and forth between those, okay? Then we have the A minor, like I said, the F, a G and a C. Now in the pre-chorus, it's going to be the C, the F, G, the A minor, F, G, E7, okay? And then in the chorus, it's F, A minor, F, C, G, C. Just a really neat thing. Now I did throw the G7 down here. It makes an excellent segue to the next uh, verse. So go stop the video, come back to this at any time. You can look at the placement, and that's for every dot, that's where you press down on the string, okay? So I'm gonna leave that right here for us. It's a little matter of reference, and here we go. Today I'm going to do just the um, strumming, so you can add um, as you get better at this, different finger patterns, and it's just beautiful um, song. So, so here we are. We got a C, A minor, C, A minor, the F, the G, and the C to the G7. Think of it as like a triangle, but the point at the top, kind of like a church steeple. Here, here, and here. Excellent segue to the next verse. Now the pre-chorus. C, the fourth and the fifth. These are in the um, for the circle of fifths in music theory. The minor fall, think of A minor, and the major left, the F. The baffled king is a G. And then we've got an E7. And then an A minor. Now we have the chorus. Hallelujah with the F. And then the A minor. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. What you might not be able to see because of the uh, camera angle is I was just doing this one. just running my thumb down them but I think when we start we'll just do the um, the actual strumming because it's easier but here's a little tip for you as you become a little bit better at it, and this takes practice, I would start with your thumb right here at the string closest to you, okay? Pluck it, 
and then you got your first finger, the next string, the third finger in the middle, and your ring finger on the A string. So it's um, like this. Let's get a C chord going. So it's running up the strings and back down the strings. Kind of a one, two, three, four, five, six, isn't it? Listen. One, two, three, four, five, six. isn't it? It takes time to get to that, um, but practice it because it will sound really cool. So there's the song. Um, let's just do a quick run through. Remember you can always stop the video anytime and go back through and practice it. But let's start with the C. I'll call out the chords. Ready? Let's do the introduction. It's C, A minor, C, A minor. Let's try that. A minor, C, A minor. I heard there was a secret chord, C, that David played, and it pleased the Lord. So far, so good, right? All right. Now, right here, while our finger's stuck on that A minor, throw your finger down right there, and you'll have the F. You don't really to the G careful music do you see and our G7 once again it's like a little triangle but the point is up here like a church steeple now pre-chorus it's a C it goes like this now here's where the timing goes very quickly to the F and G and it goes pretty quick the fourth, the fifth. Then it goes to the minor fall, the A minor. The minor fall to the F, major lift. To the G, the baffled king. To the E7, composing. To the A minor, hallelujah. Chorus, F, hallelujah. To the A minor, hallelujah. To the F, hallelujah. To the C, hallelujah. Faith was strong, you needed proof. See, you can keep going on different styles. That one I use just an island strum. Down, down, up, up, down, up. Ready? C. Down, down, up. Think of staying up. Up, down, up. Down, down, up. Up, down, up. F. And just an up and down strum. I think 10 minutes is far enough to go over the chords. You see that the placements here, I will have it on my Patreon page for you to get. And just remember, you can go back through and look at the video, get your finger placement. So anyway, let's just go ahead and do the song. secret chord that David played and it pleased the Lord but you don't really care for music do you it goes like this the fourth the fifth the minor fall the major lift the baffled king composing hallelujah hallelujah
check back in. We'll have another tutorial very soon. Thanks for watching.